skills of uh, ai in my life and i got opportunity to implement and showcase my practical learnings from the ai course so i'm just uh, sharing my screen okay yes ma'am your time is start okay so my uk use cases uh, rpa for effective interest rate and calculation and uh, preparation of amortization schedule which i have prepared using a ai tool which is a low code application uh, developer lovable so what is the problem statement uh, whenever organization uh, take loan uh, so it incurred uh, some transaction cost uh, which includes processing fees so in accounting standards we do the accounting uh, we expense the processing fees directly into into the pnl but now in in indian accounting standard those applicable uh, to the listed or uh, companies who having net worth uh, more than 250 crores they have to follow the amortization cost method in this case and they have to calculate the effective interest rate and they have to prepare the amortization table manually how we are doing we are using the goal seek so this is uh, this is the schedule we got the got from the bank the payment schedule and this information so we have to use the goal seek so i have already applied these formulas uh, so i'm just copying it you can see i have i am just using the goal seek uh, formula here so we got this uh, eir calculating using the goal seek in excel but in organizations we have more than uh, more than uh, 10 or 20 loans for one organization so i have prepared a application using the ai tool lovable uh, which is a robotic process automation so what i have done so i i am just going to demonstrate it so this is the this is the that tool so i just have to input this information loan amount interest we have uh, got the option uh, to put the processing fees in percentage or in fixed amount so in this case i have uh, processing fees in fixed amount and loan tenure we can choose it for years or months so 24 months so you can see 16.9 uh, 9171 when i will put the information emi amount 210541 and uh, i have to select the period so the period is uh, 1st may 2023 to 31st may 2000 23 and that start date of repayment i have to give so with it with a click you will see uh, we are able to uh, generate the amortization schedule and we can also download a csv file of that next part what kind of technology i have used i have used a application which is a ai tool uh, which is a no code app developer so i haven't write any code i haven't used chat gpt to write any code it just i give some prompts and it created that full fledged rpa tool for me it used user interface react and for the back end it used superbase or node js how this build, uh, tool was built i'm going to demonstrate that so i have written uh, the whole prompt here so i'm just copy pasting that prompt in this lovable app you have just you have to just paste it just click on this button you are not doing anything you are not writing any code you have just 
properly given the prompt what uh, what uh, what was the manual process of uh, doing this uh, calculation of eir so it will create a user interface also it will uh, automatically generate the logics behind that and for the amortization uh, table i'm just giving the next prompt it is just taking some time to develop this uh, user interface so you can see it has created a user interface okay and i'm just uh, adding this amortization table also okay this is the interface for eir calculation and uh, i'm just using these information also only so it is based on the cash flow analysis and uh, the pro this is the prompt for uh, adding the amortization table so within one minute is it is also adding this uh, feature of uh, creating amortization table from from the same you can see how uh, it is editing and it is uh, writing codes or uh, for the for creating the uh, structure for the yes 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 ma'am so it will take only half minute to do the another another step uh, integrated in this eir calculator so here here is the result so i can put uh, here 10000 so you can see the amortization schedule so i am done with my presentations so Jury, you can ask your questions. Yeah, very nicely done and very thoughtful. Uh, any idea what is the uh, the backend code uh, the Lovable has written on? Uh, Sir, so they have used uh, HTML uh, thing for writing the code. Right. Yeah. Yes. Asha. Great, Indraji ji. Uh, as you have shown also that how it has to be done this is a yes. good thing thank you plus also i think uh, that this time we have done it with lovable 
we could also tell them that uh, yeah. if we start learning some uh, basic understanding of uh, html also we can develop a simple home page uh, simple html file uh, code for our uh, uh, desktop and we can yes. do it uh, offline as well yes so i can that could also be one thing that you could have included but yes overall it was uh, fine and uh, good